um, we're going to move on and talk about the family system now. So those of you guys who are familiar with the family system, it is a pretty long time system uh, introduced with the release of the game. Originally, the family system supported eight members. They could be cross-faction, and it was really just, um, you know, kind of a, a chat channel or permissions for your house. Um, over time, we've seen players use the family system to kind of create a micro guild or maybe just a management of, like, their real-life friend group. Um, but it really became this kind of system that was used to support small group play. The Revelation update enhances that. And this is a system that we've seen grow and change based on the way players play Arc Age. Uh, the family system is developed to support people um, who play using that smaller group. Now, the family system is extended. Um, our current live version supports 10 people, um, but in 3.0 it will support up to 12 people. You have to extend the size of your family by using a certificate. Um, but it can be up to 12 people. The rules are still the same. You can still have your pirate uncle in there or your cross-faction alts or whatever you want to put in your family. You can still do that. Supports up to 12 people. Now, um, family members get different roles. And these roles are mostly a role-play thing. Um, you can set what uh, title you'd like them to have. Sorry, again, this is like an internal version that doesn't have all the correct translations yet. But yeah, those are the different titles that you can... Yeah, and there's, there's like seven or eight of them, and you can assign them um, as appropriate. And so family play changes a lot, um, mostly because when you're in a family group, you now have daily tasks that you can undertake. Um, and we can show that in a window. We can't unlock them in this build, but what we're going to do is one, uh, demonstrate one of the activities that families can do. Now, these are like merit um, quests <laughs> or guild quests, and uh, you do them on a daily basis. And so, yeah, take it away. Let's see what it looks yeah. like. And just to bring it up real quick, you do those daily so you can get, um, you get vacation for it, you get uh, family experience so you can upgrade your family, you also get buffs for your families. So you want to upgrade it so you can take advantage of those buffs, which starts out as vocational uh, benefits. And then it adds on top a movement speed while carrying tripack, and then at the end you also get a um, fishing boat. Uh, what's that? Duration of four wind. For fishing boats and merchant schooners are is, is extended. So this is one of the quests, one of the new quests that come with the families, which I kind of like because it um, it asks people to work together to complete the tasks. Now in this version, you have to cook a local stew for the community, um, and you see you have like different roles that you can choose from. What depending on what task is going to be with um, within this, I'm gonna go for. Oh, this is all uh, not updated again. I'm gonna go for F. This is gonna be my role for this. And then I have my two other family members here, which you can see are opposite faction, but we can still work together. So I'll go ahead and start this quest. Now everybody has picked their roles, I hope. Um, now this looks a lot similar like sport fishing. You target the thing and you see which buff comes up. If it matches your task, you have to go ahead and do it. And then it's basically, for this specific quest, you have to go all the way until the cooking pot is fully is filled and then you can grab these two for it. There's all kinds of different ones. One is like a, a, a huge tree which you have to chop down so you wait until you have to, like you wait until it's your turn. Now I have to ask some tough questions. Yeah. If I have a greater cooking skill, does it affect this yes, at all? Yes, it does. Not all of them, I believe, but certain quests, um, it does affect, your proficiency affects how quickly you get to a task. So for this one, for example, if you have a higher cooking proficiency, you're going to be able to complete this faster.